Alright, there we go. Just put uh, the final touches on this. And oh, hold on a second. Okay, well, okay, Skippy, I'm coming. Alright, here we are. So, yep, okay, yep, I know. Make the button. Alright, got it. Um, Yep, the final ingredient, really. So, let's just go. Whoop, not in there, that's the chest. Um, let's, this is the crafting table. And let's just go use the stone. There's also a button. So, uh, there we go. So, uh, you're. You're not gonna, you're not gonna come down and see Skippy of uh, of how I'm going to go uh, inside an Enderman. Nope. Okay. All right. Well, uh, yeah, well, just letting you know that. Yeah, let's go down here. Here we are. All right. Well, at least you'll see pickles. So let's go. Just smack the button right here. I'm gonna go move you away from here if you quickly uh, pickles, because you may be, you may catch up kind of like, um, you may kind of turn small with me and I don't really want that to happen do we um you really want that to happen do you so uh yep this is good that's probably a little bit too far but yeah I'm gonna just scoop you kind of test dogs right here but don't worry you're still loyal so uh yep with that said let's go inside an enderman three two one whoa here we go we're shrieking Oh, uh, all right. Whoa, what's a chicken doing here in an Enderman? Uh, well, what am I doing here? Uh, I think it's because, oh, shrink away. Heh, <laughs> obviously. So, uh, well, it looks like this is inside the Enderman, uh, head. Because these are its size. Rub, rub. Yeah, it's a little uncomfortable from that. I won't do it. So, uh, yeah. Well, looks like I'm here. So, uh, looks like I'll... I'll go, uh, I'll go explain you guys, because some of this stuff is kind of complex, and, uh, I think you guys may want to know. <laughs> Look at, I think another under chicken just came here. Um, maybe, well, start a little baby, but you may get a little bored. So, uh, yeah, anyway, that's kind of interesting. So, uh, yeah, it looks like right here we got these chickens that are kind of clucking away. I believe, um, these chickens, uh, with this kind of end, portal frame, kind of make it teleport, uh, since, like, end portal frame teleports you to the end, that's also how it gets away from the end, um, gets out of the end and just really teleports that way, so it looks like these chickens, I think one of them, like, the signal will come from here, these end crystals probably go, like, its eyes and its brain and, um, parts of both of those and how it sees that way, well, actually, those are its eyes, but, uh, yeah, that little, I believe, stuff I can't say specifically. But, uh, yeah, one of those, these chickens kind of go teleports to, uh, we get signal goes to the chicken. That is, then the other three chickens are the X, Y, and Z chickens, which are like the kind of coronets. <laughs> Looks like that baby chicken is definitely not happy to be here. So, yeah, anyway, let's go see. So, this is its head, I believe. So, we'll go down to the really rest of it, the place. So let's go see here. Looks like there's kind of an opening right here. Let's go. Oh, this is not too much damage. So let's see. Oh, I think this right here is kind of its its noise. Let's go try this out. This is going to be so weird to it. Yep. Oh, look, it, it, it sounds literally just like an Enderman. Of course. Well, it actually probably shouldn't be doing it because it may be kind of uncomfortable, um, like this said, because uh, they... Because they, uh, this is how really it's noise box. I bet probably those end crystals kind of also come up with other ways, it, things it could do. And one is probably this, uh, weird going on its vocal cords. But, uh, yeah, let's go see right here. Yep, all right. And, uh, yeah, let's go see here. I think right here is kind of like more of an activated thing. Oh, look. Oh, yes. I think this can kind of do something. I think... Can, yeah, it seems like kind of a push and pull thing. I think it's, is that its neck or something? I don't know. I, um, these things, I think, yeah, I think that's its neck. I think these are, um, how it basically gets its stuff. Um, uh, I think maybe the particles kind of, there's none right now, since we're kind of checking inside. Speaking of which, for those chickens over there, they they were like walking all the pressure places. They can't really actually teleport anywhere because uh, because he's in a side or cobweb. So anyway, it looks like he could like activate these pressure plates. So it looks like Enderman also have kind of redstone signal inside them. Interesting. So uh, let's go down here once again. Ooh, what does this lever do? 
Let's go see. Whoa! Ah! Oh, ah, ah, okay, this is this is weird. Go, go slow it down. There we go. So it looks like uh looks like we're probably like by right, stomach or something right here. It looks like this can actually like really move its stomach. I don't really think it can do. Maybe oh it's 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 probably its arm. Yeah, let's go. Let's go try this out. Let's see. I think yeah, I, I could see about the same thing on that thing too, so that's probably the arms. I don't really see the same thing for the uh, two, for really the two things to have it on its arms, but let's just go do this for fun. <laughs> just, I'm pretty sure right now he's dancing, so oh well, at least I can kind of make a little show for the dogs right here, so. Alright, let's go. Yeah, wait, now I'll go turn it off. There we go. And, yep, yeah, alright. So let's go down here more, and oh, okay, yep, as you can see we have some items there. It's kind of a long fall if we miss that. I think these are like all the items it could carry. I think this could also, I think this part both can, uh, if we're up there again, I'm sure this can also move its arms and also carry them. But once again, you can't really carry anything. So, oh, that's why, because you don't normally see Endermen moving their arms around. They just only pick up blocks. So for that reason, he has like all the blocks and can carry up. Looks like it's kind of like code and bended and, uh, Stuff like that. Um, basically, its code kind of corrupted this part, and uh, can really only do this stuff. I think I could do a little more, like pistons, redstone. Looks like these are all just all the basics, and kind of like the leads, like pumpkin. It can also do jack lantern, stuff like that. So, uh, all right, let's go. Let's go do it, guys. One, two, three. Yep. All right, there we go. Looks like these sticky pistons still kind of dead. Okay, no, wait, these move its arms kind of forward. Let's go look here, and uh, let's see, there's a little something down here. Yeah, I think these are now its legs. Its arms are pretty wide, so uh, let's go see that we're going to take some damage. Yep, all right, here we are. So uh, right now we are at the bottom of its heels right now, I believe, so. Yep, sticky pistons. Oh, wait, no, not quite, so let's go look at this. Yeah, look at these. I bet these are now its kind of legs moving. Yep, and oh, wait, I think... These also have one last thing. If those are the legs, oh, I think actually, I think these are um, these are like its particles of what affects its particles. That's why there's like constant redstone. So basically, I'm sure these constantly come like they emit the particles and such. And um, yep, that's kind of interesting because that's why there's kind of more solid. Why this is just its normal particles, um, as it normally has, but these just really create more and really, like, can make it do more stuff, I believe, make it more into motion. So let's go down here to its leg, definitely. So it looks like, looks like we kind of have the same thing for the arms for the leg. So, uh, let's go here. Oh, yep, kind of took, so, uh, yeah, these are, this is its legs, because all of this are kind of, like, muscles, and, oh, looks like it's ends here. Um... I think, wait, what was that? Um, I think the kind of particle, I think it both did that and the legs. So, uh, well, we're kind of stuck down here. Oh, well, that's fine. And, oh, okay, well, I think we, I think that's kind of good. At least we explored it all, but oh, not the street, the street, great. Okay, well, hold on a second. I'm going to get more size again, and my hands is normal size, and, uh, outside of an Enderman, um, yeah, did you feel something kind of weird while I was, I was inside you? Yeah, I figured. Um, what? Yep, hi, pickles. Hello, dogs. I could kind of see. Looks like you guys were fine as I was gone. But, uh, hold on a second. What, what, where was the shrinking machine? Wait a second. You took it? But uh, I, I was inside you. What? I was inside you and you took it? Okay, hold on a second. Let's go look around here. Um... Yep, look back here. All right, let's go. Look around. Just back here. Whoa. <laughs> uh, the, well, here's the shrinking um, potion dispenser. Um, looks like while I was inside the Enderman, it made me build all this. Uh, that's a little strange, I'll be honest. Um, let's go look around here. But, yeah, it is pretty much everything I did, too. So, uh... Let's get see here. So this is like all the code things that the Enderman can pick up. That doesn't look too exact, but I think it's probably just because of the supplies I had. Um, then here is the um, 
the kind of like the particle emitter, um, and kind of muscle, kind of excretory system, mm, kind of just an excretory emission system thing. So wait, hold on. Yeah, okay, like, I remember, like, the particles were a little darker there, and yet they're here. So that means, um, it kind of also sounds a lot like an Enderman. This is an Eye of Ender, which, uh, I don't know, I'm about to go kablooey. Uh, okay, uh, alright, I think that's because I was looking at this. It's, it's used to really teleport around. And a chicken. I see you've been clicking at me about the whole time, haven't you, um, Mr. Clucky? Yep, you have. Uh, these were the ones that actually kind of functioned this part. And yep, here it is, the potion of screenking. Let's go look right here. Yep, sure enough it says that. Okay, so good, Miss Bell. Alright, well, uh, uh, especially depending on the Miss Bell of that we're I'm pretty ready to, um, and about everything else by exploring the Endermen, I'm pretty ready of just ending it right here. So it's just that. But thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed. It's definitely interesting to see what's inside an Enderman, but I do not want to go there again. But looks like now I will see you later on the games. Bye.